Regulators can be very important in medium income countries. The kind of regulators we're talking about here are the infrastructure industry regulators as for energy and telecoms and airports and so on. And they can set a framework which is provides good quality of service and fair prices to consumers while allowing the companies to earn a reasonable rate of return but contain their monopoly power. The important thing about good regulatory practice is to keep an idea of the regulatory principles and different countries will apply those principles in different ways institutionally and the, the principles that have, have become most important are transparency, which is openness, ensuring that all parties can contribute and having good explanations and also predictability and those things are most important um, and countries pursue them in various ways and they can also benefit by talking to one another. Regulators should meet internationally and compare best practice. I've only been in Peru for a few days, so it would be very silly of me to try and comment. But I would encourage the development um, and furtherance of accountability and transparency and keeping an open mind and also, of course, increasingly the use of digital tools. And um, it's been found in the UK and the European Union that enabling consumer choice, one of the ways of doing this is developing appropriate digital tools. And equally in something like control of, uh, we, of the electricity flows and so on, a lot of the systems that we have had are increasingly going to use algorithms and possibly artificial intelligence. And the regulator has to be able to understand where these tools can be beneficial and also what can go wrong with them.